I'm Ronald Kaluya from Uganda, the founder of Uganda Counseling and Support Services. I grew up in a village called Wakitaka. And every day in Wakitaka, we experienced a lot of suffering. Growing up that way, we saw a lot of people who had no medication. We saw a lot of people that didn't have enough to eat and actually walking on barefoot. So as I talked to my mom about that, the conditions that we were seeing, she said that, son, what you are seeing here is not suffering. Wait till you see where I grew up from. As a teenager, I went for a burial in Buriki and I came face to face with true suffering. The people in Buriki had nothing. They didn't have fresh water to drink. They didn't have medication to treat their diseases. They did not have an opportunity to send their children to school. They didn't have anything to do economically. No, did they have any exposure to the love of God. When they wanted water to drink, they walked miles to fetch dirty water from a pond. Imagine your child falling sick and not having medication to be able to treat your child for a treatment that would cost less than ten dollars. It could never leave my heart and I carried that with me everywhere I went. In 2011 I had finished studies in America and we developed a non-profit called Uganda Counseling and Support Services. The mission of UCSS is to improve lives and spread God's love to people in remote communities through spiritual, emotional, and meeting their basic physical needs. Hello, my name is Sheldon Stevens. I'm the finance chair and treasurer of UCSS. I became involved with UCSS back in 2014. I went on a mission trip to Uganda, and I'm telling you, I was just taken by this ministry, this mission. Uh, I've just seen what this does, and I've seen the impact that this ministry has had in such a short time. It is just an amazing thing that UCSS has done and is doing. I think about a story of one of the youth we met in the community of Buliki. His life was depressed. He was lost. Godfrey didn't know how his life would turn out. But through the effort of UCSS, he was introduced to the love of Christ. He started lighting up, he started smiling, and then he became involved in an economic group where he was given a goat. And he worked diligently to take care of his goat. Godfrey has more than 68 goats. From not having anything to do, from living a life of despair, to living a life of hope, where he can take care of himself. Our goal is to continue, improve the quality of life, 
one community at a time through providing education for the students. You can do that when you sponsor a child at $25 a month to provide fresh clean water for the community. You can do that by supporting to drill a water well. We aim at evangelizing and making disciples true leaders that will continue to spread the love of God in the communities that we are serving. We also aim at productively producing crops when you give to UCSS. You are saving lives spiritually and physically. And you are providing a means for people to be self-supporting. Just my position uh, in UCSS on the board and, and being treasurer, I see, you know, the accountability and, and what these funds go for and how they're helping and making a difference in UCSS and, and the people in Uganda. I see what a difference just a little money makes uh, in Uganda, you know, the difference that it can make in a life, it can save a life, the difference it can, in, it can give in, in the hope for a better life. Like I say, this is just something I am so proud to be uh, involved in. The Lord has blessed me through this, and I know He'll bless you through this opportunity too. So thank you for your contribution, and thank you for your support, and thank you for your prayers most of all. To learn more about how you can support Uganda Counseling and Support Services, or how you can schedule a mission trip, please visit ugandacss.org today.